First, search for iFacial Macap in the Microsoft Store. Press the Install button to begin installation. After installation, open the application. In order to use highly accurate face tracking with a webcam, you have to use a Windows machine with an NVIDIA RTX series GPU. At first startup, the message, NVIDIA's ARSDK is required, will appear. After some time has elapsed after startup, the ARSDK installer will be launched, so install it. After installing the ARSDK, close the application and reopen it. If you start the application immediately after the SDK installation, you may be asked to install the SDK again, but please ignore this. Ready for face tracking by web camera. If your PC is connected to a webcam, your avatar will appear on your PC screen. After pressing the Open Advanced Settings button, press the Add-on button. Open the sample avatar file from the folder. Go to Edit Right Pointing Arrow Preference and install the add-on from the folder. Find the add-on for iFacial Macap and check it out. Press the N key on the keyboard to display the add-on, then press the Waiting for Connection button. Press the Connect to Blender button. It is connected and works in real time. Let's see how the sample avatars work. If you select the skin of this sample avatar, you will see that it has 52 shape keys. If you create shape keys for a custom avatar using this sample avatar's shape keys as a reference, you can move the custom avatar as well. Learn how to move your custom avatar. Let's start with a simple cube. Select the cube and create a shape key. Let's name the shape key, jaw open. Move the vertex. Jaw open is a shape key that the sample avatar also has. In this example, the name of the object with shape key is cube, so face object GRP name is set to cube. Press the waiting for connection button and then the connect to blender button. Cube has moved. Use Shift plus a keys to create armature. Select the cube and bone and use Ctrl plus P to weight them. Rotating the bone now also rotates the cube. In the head bone field, enter the bone name. The connection also allows the bone to rotate. Move multiple meshes. Add a new mesh to the scene.
add jaw open shape key Make cube the parent of cone. When connected, cube and cone move at the same time. In this case, cube is specified as face object GRP name, so that all shape keys of meshes in the hierarchy of face object GRP name can be retrieved and moved. 